The MQ-9B aircraft has an endurance of 30 plus hours, can fly at altitude up to 40,000 feet. It has the capability to provide real-time video, it can be deployed as an airborne outpost guarding the Indian borders. The current version of the aircraft has no weapon fit and is purely a surveillance platform. The weapon and sensor fit of the new aircraft will significantly enhance the combat capability and survivability of the aircraft. India has vast EZ of 2.37 million square nautical miles and around 80% of the world's maritime oil passes through the Indian Ocean. Indian Navy has a need to ensure the safety and security of the EZ while ensuring the lawful use of the high seas. 15 of these aircraft will provide the Indian Navy to cost effectively maintain a strict vigil over the areas. The aircraft which we have here is MQ-9 Bravos and uh, there are few major payloads here so we have two fixed cameras here, a day camera, a night camera. So it is used for max mainly for landing and takeoffs. It's also called pano cameras to follow the yellow yellow markings on the runway and stuff. And then we have the main EOIR electro optic camera sensor. This is mounted on a gimbal which can rotate 360 degrees during the missions. So it takes all mission feed and provides live feed to the ground base. And another major payload we have here is the radar. It's a MPR maritime patrol radar which is used to scan targets in sea environments. 